guys welcome to my channel data driven decision in this channel i talk about the data science and machine learning kind of stuff if you are down for that please subscribe to my channel and see different kind of awesome videos i make for data science so today's topic is all about the probability so what is the probability is all about so in probability you can understand the behavior of uh, different different circumstances actually so you can basically quantify those things for an example if you have a dice like if you have a coin so suppose you have a coin okay one rupee coin you have one rupee coin so in the coin suppose this side is a head and the other side okay this is the tail side so whenever you flip this particular coin every time uh, the probability or the uh, quantifiable outcome of any of the events basically events over here are the suppose tail is the one event and head is the one event events okay so it depends on the events so whenever you just flip the coin either head or tail is going to appear in the uh, circumstances okay so the what is what will be the probability of it so suppose there are two events so any one of them could happen at the same time so it will be around 1 by 2 it is going to be around uh, 0 0.5 or you can tell it as a 50 percent probability so this particular example okay so basically you have to think of out of the total uh, number of combinations or out of total number of events what is the probability of one event uh, to happen or, or you can think of out of total possibilities what is the possibility of this particular event so here the out of total possibility is 1 so suppose the total possibility over here is a 2 okay and uh, um, the occurrence of a particular event that is tail or head is only 1 so that is why it is around 1 by 2 that is 50 percent probability so so in the similar way you can also do the probabilities of uh, different different events over here so another example i can tell you is that uh, there is a dice okay so in this particular dice uh, there are dice so one four five so there are different different numbers in the dice it ranges from one to six okay one is the smallest one six is the largest one and the total what are the total uh, possible events could happen from this so the total possible events are six over here okay and any one of them could happen at the same time so that is what is all about so it is about one out of six similar to the dice there was total possible events were two but over here the total possible events are six so and all of them are independent to each other okay so at the same time only one event can appear so if you roll the dice you can only see only one out of the total six possibilities so that is why it is one by six okay so this is the probability probability of the event and this one by six it is going to be same for everyone suppose for one it is one by six for 2 it is 1 by 6 plus 3 it is 1 by 6 okay plus uh, 4 it is 1 by 6 1 by 6 2 3 4 5 it is 1 by 6 and 6 it is 1 by 6 so the total sum would be around 1 2 3 4 5 6 so it is going to be around 6 by 6 so the total probability is 1 so the probability can only be 1 the 100% probability and one of them are the 
fraction of the that particular probability so in that case it is subdivided into six parts and for the dice it was subdivided into two parts that is 50 percent probability so it is all about today so i hope you like the video if you like it please subscribe to my channel and see different kind of videos and make for data science thanks for watching my videos thank you